Good afternoon, welcome to Hochanda. My name's Hannah and you've joined me and the lovely Kay uh, for the one day special um, which runs until tonight. Um, absolutely fantastic one day special but not long left um, to get the um, the wonderful deal that we've got for you. So this is Faber Castell, isn't it? It is. Um, Gelatos. Gelatos. I know. So Sounds exciting. Yes. Can you tell us a bit about them? I've never seen them before. They are amazing. They're little pots of delicious, creamy, pigmenty art bars mm. and they are gorgeous pigment rich they are really quite famous actually in other parts of the world yeah. apart from the uk How's but strange. now you've got a chance to play with them because they are gorgeous oh, good. so they are a little stick right let me just go and get one shall i yes okay here we go so they are like little sticks yeah. and instead of an arts bar having just a wrapper around it so they break and you you get them on your hands and everything yeah. they've actually encased them in a little plastic like lipstick mm -hmm. thing or you know stuffy lip lips balm lip thing. balm yeah. thing yeah so you can push them up like so right. push them back down again there's loads in there and they're very very creamy to the touch really really soft and blendable and they're water soluble so right. you can actually mix them with water and and make washes with them do direct paper with them you can mix them with other products like texture paste slap it on oh. um, all sorts of things to color them they're just really really versatile and we'll go on loads and loads of different things <gasps> so i have a feeling that there's going to be some amazing stuff being demonstrated <laughs> today and um, so we'll go through them first and tell you exactly what you get in it okay so there's two bundles to choose from there and the are. first one is the special edition bundle do you want to talk us through these colors yes so these they? are absolutely gorgeous so okay. this special edition you're actually getting uh, four different packs and you're getting um every one of these packs not right. there's no choice you get all four oh, wow. so um, they have masquerade with a brush and at the bottom there is like a, a wooden holder with a, a dauber on the top oh, right. you are also getting a 1950s diner which is just going out of shot now with the red the banana the blue and yeah. the brown um, you're also getting at the bottom there the neutrals and I have actually some neutrals here as well which I can show you those are the neutrals so it's kind of a skin pigmenty color at That's the top right. yes and just absolutely so yeah. the top, a lovely sort of buttergum, um, bubblegum mm. uh, look, uh, a grey, and then you've also got those beautiful brights there. Lovely. So those are actually metallics, so um, you're getting a beautiful metallic mint, a blue, a purple, and uh, like a, a guava sort of colour. Is that, are those? Oh no, those... Um, that guava isn't, that's melon, metallic melon, oh. beg your pardon. And you get a little stamp. But you get the stamp, you get these really nice brushes as well, and you also get a watercolour pad as well, oh, which fantastic. is amazing value. I think it's a brilliant price, actually, personally. It is um, for absolutely gelato. incredible. It's brilliant. And we have actually got a few lovely, lovely samples here. So, yeah, let's see what you can actually do with them. So, we have got um, a team of three girls who have done amazing work, actually, this week. Yep. So, Jenny Marples has done this one here using oh, wow. all of these are using this kit this special edition kit so you've got lovely neutrals on there and she's used them with a stamp uh, as a resist and painted on and here she's actually used it with the stencil as well it's gorgeous really isn't it? really gorgeous um, we've also got work by um, Sue Ralph and this is um, by Sue and again you can get that lovely vibrant color wow. you can this is actually stenciled the words are stenciled there okay Lovely. Um, and then this is so delicate. Sorry, the cameras will just take a minute just to focus there. So this is really, really soft and delicate. I'll just move it that way. And that's Elizabeth yeah. Robinson. She's done that. And you can see how she's got a really soft look to that, which is absolutely beautiful. It's lovely. Um, and again, the lovely Ooh, thing look. about these is they are so bright vibrant and yeah. bright and really really pigment rich and you can go in and see all that texture you get on the background because they're water soluble but also mm. the vibrancy of of the color load on those and of course you can die cut them beautifully as well Wonderful. Gosh, so we've oh, got really one. really beautiful stuff <laughs> now this is texture paste 
Ah, so the really yes. rough, lovely texture paste here, and then it's been coloured. It's been actually um, coloured beforehand and afterwards. So I think Sue's done that one. Yes, she has. Yeah. That's fabulous, isn't it? So Definitely. there's so many different ways you can use them. I'll show you some more later on, shall okay, we? Okay, yeah. Is that all right? Fantastic. Um, so this is your first bundle. This is a special edition, including the 1950s diner and then the masquerade. Um, absolutely gorgeous. £29.99 for the one-day special. A fantastic price, considering you are getting all four packs and a watercolour pad as well. Um, you're saving £11.92 pence but at the end of the day it does go back up um, to £41.91 and um, so definitely get yours now. Um, over 50% of this bundle has gone um, so it's been very very popular yes. hasn't it and yes. it is lovely really absolutely popular. gorgeous. 255912 you'll see Kay demonstrating it and you'll see all the lovely things you can do with it. Um, in a minute. Um, so then we've got the other bundle. The next bundle, yes, this is all the bright. So right. this is all your staple colours and I mean they're absolutely delicious. So I mean normally I'm not a green person but the yeah. greens in this are absolutely wonderful. So you can wow. see there you've got from an olive green all the way through to emerald green. You've got a little stamp as well yeah. and you've also got a brush. All of these sets have a brush and a different stamp attached. You've got the reds and, p and pinks. So that goes from a beautiful rich red to a more lavender you've got guava there which is one of my favorites That's I think gorgeous, isn't becoming, it? I keep going for that one yes. and a lovely <laughs> pink um, you've also got the, um, the yellow yes you've got the yellows there yeah. you go um, now the yellows incorporate the beautiful oranges as well and yeah. these are such a lovely lovely color of orange the very pure tangerine color yeah. really beautiful and of course uh, the blues there um, which go from a sky blue all the way through to an indigo color beautiful. you've got stamps and you've got um, paintbrushes again and you also get an, another pad so you get a, a watercolour pad with 10 sheets and I must say it's a really nice quality watercolour pad this. It I've looks it actually. This. I was um, nice feeling thick, it earlier. Nice and heavy. Um, one side is really nicely textured, the other side is slightly smoother so that you can use it. It's double sided so you can use whichever side you fancy, whichever look you have. And yeah. I think we've got some samples there as we well. We have. Let's actually. have a look at these samples. Um, gosh there's quite a lot actually. <laughs> Maybe I'll pick up half of them so I don't <laughs> drop them all. Um, Wow, that's bright. That's Lovely, beautiful, that. isn't it? So that's using all the greens there um, and stenciling again. And that's Sue Ralph. Yeah. She's done that. It's beautiful, isn't it? That's absolutely gorgeous. I love the oranges. They just really pop Yeah, the orange really they? pops. And that's the lovely thing about them, that they the colours really do pop. Yeah. Um, and they're so pigment rich. And that's the beauty of them. And, and using it in the, um, the delivery system, the light lipstick delivery system, is really good. Of course, you can use sponges and paintbrushes and yeah. your watercolour brushes and all of that as well but I like the fact that you can load on the colour and do so much with them because a lot of water-based paints are quite kind of past kind of, thank you <laughs> they're quite pale aren't they pale and soft and yes soft and these really give you a punch yeah so you can go from really really bright to softening them and you can also mix them which I think is Elizabeth done this no, yes Elizabeth's done this yeah. so Elizabeth's actually mixed some of the colours she smooched them all in together and you can see that you don't end up with a muddy mess you, yeah. they still retain their beautiful um, vibrancy. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Let's turn that one the right way around. There we Sorry. are. <laughs> that, now that is stunning, the colours on that. Again, wow. so simple yet beautiful. Yeah. Look how the colours just mix and merge together beautifully. I think Sue might have done that as well. There yeah, we go. Yes, Sue, it's Sue. Well. I'm recognising Sue's work there. Oh, wow. They do have and the wow factor, don't they? They do, they do. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> so again, you know, these are just mixed in, uh, sprayed with water, allowing them to move and mottle yeah. and building up layers. Um, there's a bit of stenciling there. So um, you put the stencil on and you baby wipe through, which takes the colour off. Okay. So you get a negative look and you get these highlighted areas because, of course, you can reactivate them with water. So, of course, <gasps> it opens up all these great techniques. And that's what we've been trying to pack in all weekend loads and loads of techniques. Yeah, goodness me, I can't wait to see them in and action. again, this is my favourite. Yeah. Uh, this is the first thing I actually did when I got them. I, I got them out. I mean, I didn't do this one. Elizabeth's done this and she's done exactly the same in that you rip them out of the packet, you scribble them on, yeah. you throw water on and you see what happens. Yeah. And that's exactly what I did as well. And it looks amazing, doesn't it? And she's just got one lovely little double shadow stamp there, which looks superb. And you can just see all the beautiful textures and the colours merging together. It looks 
like a melting rainbow, doesn't it? It does. It looks it. really beautiful. Wow. Yeah. So um, they're so much fun, and you're going to love them if you get these, or you've already got them. Well yeah. done, because they are absolutely delicious. So Wonderful. You can tell we've had fun this week, can't yes, you? Yes, yeah, and I can't mind. The hour's only just beginning. <laughs> um, so that, that's the bright set, the one that we've just been looking at. Um, £29.99 pence again. Um, £11.92 um, is what you are saving until the end of the day um, when the one day special finishes. 255912 is your item number for that. Now, we're just going to have a quick look at this fantastic canvas. So it's not just cards that you can make. No, well, uh, obviously, if you want to do lovely backgrounds, that's great. If you want to do a little bit of mixed media, that's fantastic. If you're an artist and using watercolours or acrylics, they mix in really beautifully with them. If you're used to using oil bars, that's fantastic as oh, well, yes. because these are going to be cleaner than an oil bar, and they're water reactive, whereas um, oil bars are not. So, um, you know, it, I think it's for all ranges, from amateurs through to professionals and everything in between. Yeah. Um, and, and I really, really enjoyed doing this canvas. It it was sort of, I was about to go to bed, um, you know, I'd, I'd done my work for the day, I was tired, had a cup of tea and thought, do you know what, I'll just have a little bit of a play yeah. and um, before I knew where I was, it was two in the morning and <gasps> I was like having far too much fun <laughs> and that's the beauty of them, uh, they are so easy to work with yeah. um, and, you know, it didn't go according to plan but I actually liked the end result, you know, it's yeah. sort of was very organic but yes it was really really good fun so you're gonna absolutely love um playing with these wonderful you're so talented <laughs> sickening <laughs> <laughs> i've got um, a good team i've got a really really clever team actually behind me so and some lovely products as well. Um, so it's all on the website, hochanda.com, or you can give us a call on 01733 um, 602000. Um, and these are the Faber Castell uh, Mix and Match Gelatos. They are absolutely stunning products. Um, very, very excited to have them on the one day special today. £29.99, um, and you get four packs with that and a watercolour pad as well. So you can either choose from the brights um, or you can choose from the special edition set. Um, both absolutely gorgeous. 255912 is your item number um, and you can see them all on hochanda.com um, but we'll also be showing you them now in the demonstration so maybe um, if you're not sure which ones to choose and then you can have a little think and choose once you've seen Kay using them. Okay, you know so what, what I, gonna I was do? going to start with my demo and then I've just had a, a thought. Should I actually just, for the people who haven't actually seen anything at all, even on hmm. catch up, maybe just very, very quickly just show them the first sort of Drippage yeah. look. Should I'd we do like that? to see that. As well. I've yeah, seen you do a bit you have not seen but anything, not the have basics. you? Okay, so the first thing I did was got a piece of watercolour paper out right. and I actually placed them on the watercolour paper. But then I discovered um, from a hint from another um, artist called Donna Downey, she said, put some gesso on the watercolour paper and when you activate it with water, it just spreads more beautifully. Ooh. So um, just put a, a thin coating of, of gesso on. Right. Okay, that's going to take just a few seconds to dry. Let me just put that in there, grab this, and then we're going to choose some colours. Let's go for, um, I did have an orange, oh, there it is. Oh, there it is, yeah, we were So let's get some earlier, nice bright colours. A little bit from each one, shall we go yep. for? Um, um, yeah. Blue, got some blue, got a purple. What haven't we got? We haven't got a... Pink. Yeah. Something like that. Should we go yeah, for let's do it. rainbow colours? Okay, so that's dry. Okay, so what I did was literally I got them out of the packet and I thought, right, okay, here we go. Let's just just put plenty on. They're really soft yeah. and creamy. Can you see yeah. the consistency of them? They remind me a little bit of oil pastels. Yes, absolutely, because they have got that creamy consistency. Mm. Totally. Yeah, I get that. But these are so much cleaner to work yes. with. Yes, oh, they are messy That's, oil pastels, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, they are. Um, and so this is just a really nice way of, um, wow, of a, a great delivery system. Whoever came up with this was, is an absolute genius because um, it's just really, really clever and just so obvious when you've actually, you know, played with it. You go, why didn't anyone think of that before? <laughs> you know, it's ludicrous. So just put plenty on. Okay. Okay. Let's get some water on there, just to activate it, just across oh, wow. there, okay. And then either with a, a Q-tip or a, a dauber or with your finger, just move it around just to activate Gosh, that. look at that. There we go, 
and then I will just get a cloth underneath it. I'm just going to spin it round. Okay, so mm -hmm. in order to get it to activate the rest of the paper, you just wet <gasps> the paper. There wow! We go. Lovely. Isn't that lovely? That's turn it round a bit. Sorry, you're, you're out of action. <laughs> out of action for a second, but it'd be worth it. Just let it just drip. There we go. There we go. The orange is so vibrant, it is, isn't, isn't it? Isn't it? It's not gorgeous. Beautiful. Yeah. Really, really beautiful. <gasps> and it just just mixes so lovely. Yeah. So that was the first thing I actually did, just to have a play with it. Yeah. So let me just wipe that up. Get a clean board and let that dry and I'll, I'll come back to that in a minute. Okay. Okay, so the first time I'm going to do, I'm going to try and squeeze a few different techniques into this. Great. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is just take a little bit of slap it on and just do a little bit of stenciling through this cog stencil. I do believe we've got this on the show. This comes in yeah. a pack of three. Okay, so we're going to do a bit over there and I think we'll have a little bit there. So, and this, uh, the reason why I'm doing this is it acts as a resist because ah. our gelatos are water resistant. So, uh, sorry, water activated. Yeah. So this will resist the water. I okay? see. So that's why I'm actually putting this on because it's um, an acrylic smooth, it dries to a clear gloss. <coughs> Excuse me. So does that mean when you put the colour on, then the colour won't stick on to it? It won't. It, yeah. it will move around it. Yeah. Okay, so I've got one that's already dry here. So okay. let's just move that out of the way. Okay, and then when we apply the colour, let's go with, let's stick with that orange, because you like that orange, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> I don't <laughs> normally like orange, no, weirdly enough. Do I, but this but is that. such a lovely, lovely yeah. colour. So... I'm just putting, and it's catching the edge, but that's okay, yeah. that's all right, because when we actually smooch it around, it's going to rub around. I think I'm going to go for a, a different blue on this one. Okay. okay, so let's just put a little bit of blue on. Okay, so this one I haven't gessoed, so you'll see the difference. Right, okay. Okay. Let's get some. Uh, now this one is guava. This is your. Yeah, that's that's the one that you. Yeah, you it's know. just it's just a really nice tone. Normally I'm not sort of a pinky peachy sort of person, but that works really nicely. This is lavender. The okay. lavender is from the pink and red set from the brights. Uh -huh. The guava, I believe, that's um, from the neutrals. Right. So at the um, special edition, and I'm not really thinking about this, as you can see. I'm yes. just sort of, it's quite, I don't know, intuitive, isn't it? Yeah. And I think we'll have some texture on there as well. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to stick um, some bits of lace on. Now, I had normal um, cotton lace on a different show, so I thought we'd go with paper lace on this one. Lovely. And I've got self adhesive, so it's a lot quicker than <laughs> I had to the other one. So I thought, hmm, let's just this a little bit quicker, okay? So we're just going to put a little bit of texture. So this means that, you know, if you've got any scraps of die cuts that you've been messing about with, yeah. you can actually utilise them by putting them on, on here. Okay, just okay. putting the odd bits here and there. And those corners, there we go. And again, it just gives a different texture to what we've already got going on. And I think actually um, you've got this sort of adhesive lace on your website, actually. I'm pretty sure I got it okay. from um, uh, the boys at Be Creative. So just have a look on, on the hedgehander.com website and you, you should be able to find that. There we go. Okay. okay. Just as soon as I've got it out. <laughs> Don't want it to go to waste now. No. <coughs> and the lovely thing is that it's going to give a nice bit of 
texture and it's going to adhere to all of that so let me just smooch that down did you say it was paper lace it is paper lace okay. yes so yeah. the, the colors will go over so that. the colors will yeah. go over those and be absorbed into that okay and then I'm actually going to get um, a baby wipe so instead of using my finger I'm just going to use a baby wipe this time okay. just to smooch it around my baby wipes a little Ooh. bit dry actually it's been out too long it's a bit damper and I'm going to smooch this around a little bit oh lovely and this gives you a softer look because we've yes. done the drippage one yeah and this is like the baby wipe smooch <laughs> Sounds like a dance, like doesn't it? Say, it? The baby wipes me. Fifties dance. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Quite appropriate since I'm using the fifties diner yeah. ones. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're now singing in my ear. Yes, yes, mine too. <laughs> Please stop. <laughs> Please stop. I think they've just made up the um the baby wipe smooch yeah that sounds really good now see how it grabs hold of it now i don't like this blue here so okay. the cool thing is that we can actually go over the top of that and lay down more right and i think we'll have some over here and here doesn't that orange look amazing it is a stunning color i'm loving that and that's in the brights isn't it's it? in the brights yeah. um yeah so the blue's in the brights that is gorgeous. What else should we go for? Should we? I know. So this is the fifties diner. That's Ooh, that's, that's nice a too. cooler blue. Yeah. Okay. Oh, now that <gasps> fits in really nicely, doesn't Especially it? Especially with the pink. Yeah, that's right. That that fits. Really. So this is the special edition fifties okay. diner set. That's the first oh, yeah. bundle that you saw. Yeah, I'm liking yeah. that. That that works for me. But it's just all about experimentation, isn't it? Yeah. And again, get you. Your baby baby wipe smooch going down. That's going to stick down. <laughs> and just, it's up to you whether you go gentle or not, because wow. you can do all sorts with this. So that's that's getting there. Love it. Liking that. Okay. Yeah. I'd stick those bits down with a bit of slap it on, but not at the moment because. I don't want to waste time with things like that. Um, <laughs> right, so <laughs> then what I want to do is a little bit of drippage. Right. Okay, so we want it at the top and we want to lay down a bit of colour. So I think what we'll go with is we'll go with a little bit maybe of the pink and red mixed together. Okay, so okay. let's get a really good chunk layered down here. Okay. Lovely and let's get a little bit of red overlaid to give it some real oomph okay i can see what you mean about it being creamy yes because i'm just hardly putting any pressure on and it just smooches out beautifully doesn't it it does do i call my <laughs> <laughs> technical terms you know that's what it is <laughs> <It's great. laughs> Oh. I'm trying to be professional, but I'm just having far too much fun. I am sorry. Uh, so it's arty just, professionals. Yes, yeah, arty professionals. <laughs> so then I'm actually going to activate it now with a, a okay. little bit of spray. Okay. Ooh, nice. And then just let it, give it a second just to, and then activate it by smooching around with your dauber, or you can use like a, a little uh, Q-tip, you know, a, a earbud. What are they called? Um, cotton yeah, bud. Cotton bud. Yeah, yeah cotton bud. <laughs> there we go. And then to get a little bit of drippage, are you overhead? Yeah. You are overhead, Dolly, yeah. yes. <laughs> and then just bear with me. I know I'm, I'm tipping it away from you, but just bear with me. There we go. Ooh, oh, so nice. you get some nice little drippage there. Wow. Yes, liking that. That's liking gorgeous. that a lot. Yeah, me too. That's really quite effective, isn't it? Yeah. That's good, liking that. So normally I would leave that to dry naturally. Does that make the drippage um, look different if you if you dry it naturally? It, it does because with any uh, pigment, whether it, it be a paint or um, a, a, a glaze or anything like that with colour in it, if you actually heat it up, you sometimes burn off some of the pigment. Right. Um, so it's not going to be as bright, as vibrant as it would be if you let it dry naturally. Yeah. Um, that's the only thing. So normally I would sort of put it to one side, have a cup of tea, do something else, and then look back at it in half an hour's time and go, ooh, see, that's lovely. It's quite <laughs> you know, aromatic, I actually. It. The colours, can you... Oh, yeah, really it smells right. really nice. 
She's weird. I am weird. She's yeah. weird. You get used to me. <laughs> but actually, no, you do like the smell of paint and, I do love, and nice pencils and things like that, don't you? Yeah, I'm I do. quite, I like, yeah, I don't know. Do you I find yourself quite stroking tactile. them? I do, yeah. I remember I by do. smells and, and, and seeing things and, um, yeah, I'm just a bit old. No, you're not old at all. <laughs> It does have a smell to it though, a nice smell. So it's not completely dry, but I'm going to leave it there for now. I'm just going to tidy up that edge a, a wee bit. Okay. Um, I would have um, just distressed the edges a little bit, but I want to make okay. sure we've got plenty of other demos to do. So you don't need to see me do that. So let me just put that in water. And then what I've done is I've stamped some words here. Um, and all I've done to edge it is I've actually just put some of the gelatos on my craft mat, mm -hmm. added a little bit of water and just taken a paintbrush and just edged it. Okay. And in actual fact those little textures on there are my baby wipe uh -huh. where I've just literally just put a little bit of extra texture on there. There we go with a little bit of orange on there. And I still don't like that blue area so that's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. See, this is it. It doesn't matter if yeah. there's areas that you're not quite happy with, but I love the way it's mixed there. Yeah. And it's grabbed hold of the edge of those um, those cogs, and you can see the white through of the original watercolour card. I love the way that the pink and the red have mixed together. Yes. Yeah, absolutely. It made it really kind and of... And you don't get a muddiness to it, do you? No. You get lovely, clear colours to that. So there you <gasps> go. So that's... Fantastic. That's really nice. And that was the original one that, oh, let me just mount it up because I have actually gone to the trouble of, of getting the mount ready. So I might oh, as well. Then you just, must. <laughs> I must put that on. Um, so um, if you want to give me. Sure, I'll give you a couple of seconds. Um, okay. We'll go through um, the recap of exactly what you get in the bundles. Um, these are the Faber Castell um, gelatos. They are absolutely beautiful. Um, it's the one day special, so it finishes at eight o'clock tonight. £29.99 and pence. And for that, you get four packs um, of four um, gelatos. Gorgeous. Um, and the two different packs are the Brights and also the um, special, ooh, special edition bundle. Um, you're saving £11.92 but at 8, eight o'clock tonight it goes up to 41 pounds 91 255 912 is your item number and you also get that watercolor paper um, as well but i'll go through the bundles um, in more detail right now so so here they are uh, this is the special edition bundle gorgeous um you get the oh over half the stock of these have gone um just to let you know so you get the um 1950s diner which is fantastic which is this one here um with the lovely kind of baby blue that you just saw Kay using then you get the masquerade um with the gold and the silver and the black and the white and in each hack you get um a little kind of a, a, a blobber <laughs> A blobber, that's another technical Adorber. term. A dauber. A dauber, there we are. And, um, and a paintbrush as well. Um, and then at the bottom, um, there's these lovely, these beautiful colours here with the, um, the kind of pale pink and the mustardy yellow. Um, and then the, um, the bright red and the purple and the blue and that gorgeous kind of tealy colour at the bottom. Um, so that, yeah, just gorgeous. They're creamy, beautiful to mix as you saw Kay do earlier. And just something really different um, and it's really nice they, they are a bit like oil pastels but um, they're used with water so you get that beautiful kind of mix much less messy just something really different um, and absolutely gorgeous and you also get it with the pad so that is the uh, special edition pack 29 pounds and 99 pence brand new today 255912 and these are kind of brand new and uh, a brand new introduction into this country because they're used a lot um, around the world so so it's really nice to introduce them here today and um, because they're absolutely fantastic and then um, the second bundle over here is the other brights and boy are they really really bright you've got the greens um, you've got the the lovely pinks with the kind of lavender color um, and the bright red at the bottom fading up to the pinks and then as we go down you can see um, the yellows um, just gorgeous the yellows and the oranges very very bright bold beautiful colors they've all got a paintbrush with them and they've all got a stamp um, and then you get the blues as well and of course with the brights just as a special edition you also get the beautiful pad of watercolor um, paper 
beautiful quality. £29.99, pence, saving £11.92, but it does go up to £41.91 again tonight at 8 o'clock, 255-912. And of course, um, if you want both of them, they're under the same item number, so it's just one P and P. Yay! Yay! So oh, and give us a call on 01733 2000 or they're all on the website. Oh, and a little t uh, a little point, um, because these are coming a long way, it's going to take an extra two days for them to arrive. So yeah. just be patient. It is going to be worthwhile when you get them. You're going to love them, but yeah. uh, an extra two days, you know, just be patient. So is it about five to seven working days? It's normally five saying? to seven, but it, it's going to be an additional two days, oh, additional. apparently. Okay. Yeah. Well, there yeah. you go. But they're well worth waiting for, they we are, promise. They are. So um, this is the <gasps> the finished finished one. Oh, wow, look at that. So it's just a few little techniques. It's just playing, really, isn't it? So yeah. it's not as prescriptive as probably what you're used to, but um, it's just good fun, really good fun. So shall we... Um, yeah. Shall I go, go back to a demo? demo. demo. Yes, right? great idea. Um, so just to let you know again, £29.99. pence. Um, there they are, look, they're the brights with the watercolour paper, saving £11.92. 255 912 is your item number. Um, and then the other pack are the special edition um, with the lovely 1950s diner. Um, then you also get the masquerade, the neutrals, um, and the beautiful metallics as well. 255 912 is your item number for those. Um, and they're all on hochanda.com so you can also catch um, the demonstrations from last night and um, throughout the day today that Kay has done with all of them so you can see all the different things that you can do with them and there are a lot of things that you can do they're absolutely fantastic Ooh. so I so wanted to show you um, this is what we did earlier today so you know we did the drippage thing yeah Bob um, so when we um, did it today we did one with gesso on and one without okay um, and then I actually put some salt on top of them these aren't completely dry but um, this side is normal table salt right. and this side is sort of like the rock salt yeah. type so I just thought I'd show you the different textures so if I just rub this off, and you get a really... So this is the one where we did not Ooh. gesso it. Okay. So you can see how it grabs the colour more in the middle yeah. round here. And you get this really soft texture of the salt. You wow. do want the hairs in there as well. How did the dog hairs get in? Did you let the dog in? Yeah. <laughs> Have you ever seen I a think... sticker on our packaging? Yeah. It does actually say, does... packaged in a dog-friendly environment. Oh, does it? <laughs> it does, yeah. <laughs> um, and then this one hasn't had long enough, really, but um, this is the rock salt one, and this is the one that's been gessoed. So you can see how the colour actually spreads a lot further. Yeah. Okay, so let me bring that up to you. Wow. So Fantastic texture, isn't it? So you get texture, a really lovely texture there, don't you? So I thought it was quite good to actually see that, because a lot of people will watch on catch-up as well. Yeah. And some of the demos that I've allowed to dry naturally are like, yeah, but what does it look like? So yeah. I just thought I'd... I'd give you a catch up on those. So those are two quite different looks, aren't they? Yeah, mm -hmm. gorgeous. Are these all from the brights as well? Uh, they are, yes. Yeah. They're all from the brights. So there you go. Fantastic. Okay, so let's get rid of that. Okay. Now that we've got rid of all that salt. Okay. I shan't be putting that on my fish and chips, that's <laughs> for sure. <laughs> okay. And be careful. <laughs> and then I thought I'd just um, show you. Um, you can actually stamp with these as well. Okay, okay. so I'm going to do two different sort of stampings with this. Okay. Just to give you a different look. So um, I think, which way around should we go? I think we might go this way around actually. Mm -hmm. Or that. Mm. Okay, so colour wise, what haven't we done? Let's go with some reds, shall we? Um, Why not? And maybe a bit of purple in the centre, just because that's purple down there. So if I just put a tiny little bit in the middle there, and maybe about the bottom, okay. and then the red on top, it's not going to contaminate your gelatos. Okay. Because if you want it completely clean, you can just wipe it on a, a cloth and you're good to go again. But I, I don't worry about that because I like them mixing and merging anyway. It goes onto them beautifully, doesn't it? It does, yeah. And it's good. It's important to note that you can actually use them on all of your stamps. So your polymer stamps, um, 
your clear stamps, whatever you happen to have, they're, they're really good on everything. And of course, rubber ones. Okay. And would you so just wash it off with a water and a baby wipe or something? Yes, because they're water soluble, so yeah. they're really easy to clean up. So there's two ways you can do this. Either we can reactivate this, yeah. and that would make it move. But I, I like this texture, so I want to keep that. So in this case, I'm going to just mist the stamp. Okay. okay? So I'm just going to give this a really light mist. There we go. Let that just activate it. Okay. And then I'm going to come in and just stamp that. And so I'm just going to hold that in place for just a few seconds because that will give it a chance for the ink to activate, the pigment to activate, I should say. Okay. And then the watercolour will have just grab hold of that. And hopefully I'll have chosen a dark enough colour that you can actually see on camera. There we go. Oh, it's quite delicate. Oh, quite delicate. Maybe it's I should pretty. put a little bit more on. It's almost like a little kind of mm. shadow of yeah. dandelion, yeah, isn't it? Do that again and maybe do a, a shadow one on there. But it might be nice to actually do a darker. It's quite delicate though, isn't I it? I like Yeah, I like it. I think it looks actually, lovely. It's growing on me. <laughs> I think I might leave it because I think that's really quite soft and yummy and yeah. delicate. Let it, I'm going to let it dry because it'll darken down as well, rather than stamping again. Um, so I'm quite. Yeah, Do you know what it looks like? Me. It looks like a reflection. It does. Yeah. It does. You're absolutely right. So what I'm going to do is I'm also going to do it on a plain piece. Okay. Okay. And I'm going to do it the other way around, which I said you could wet the paper. Right. Okay. okay. So what we'll do is we'll do this again with. Um, similar colours. Where did I put the purple now? There it uh. is. I put it back in the wrong place. Of <laughs> course I did. So let's go back with the purple and let's put that. So the purple is actually called grape. Right. And the red is actually called red cherry. Ooh. So nice. Make, makes you hungry actually it when is, they call yeah. it by food. And it's making me think of ice creams, gelato and Oh I know. <laughs> it's such a perfect name for these, isn't it? It is, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, let me get this ready. Okay. So we've got the gelatos on there. This okay. time, let me move that out of the yep. way. I'm just going to give this a light misting on the actual watercolour paper. The more you wet it, the more it's going to spray out, as okay. it were, or pull, pull yeah. it out of the way. So what I want it to do is you have an image but I want it just to sort of mist out a little bit. Okay, so let's just go down with that there and again just allow it the pigment just to soak into the watercolour paper and then be activated by that water. Okay. I'm just not, I'm not pressing down hard, I'm just holding it in place for it to the pigment to transfer. Oh, <coughs> look at that. So that gives you a really nice, and can you see how it's starting to very slowly just pull out as well? Yes. Now there's more on here, so I could actually stamp this again um, on another piece. In fact, should we do that because I've got yeah, a piece why not? here? That's, that's already done. Let's go with this one. Okay. And let's see whether we can get any more out of it. So this one will be softer, okay, and a lot more faint. Okay. While, while you're doing <coughs> that, um, we've just had an email um, from, from Sarah. Hello, Sarah. Hello, um, Sarah. So Sarah's had some gelatos for ages, but oh, she's never fantastic. known what to do with them. <laughs> so she said, thank you so much um, for bringing them to Ho Chanda. Oh, she was watching last night and oh. was inspired um, to create something and get them out again. Oh, so um, she's actually shown us the picture of what she's, she's <gasps> made. Oh, oh look. my gosh, look at that, that's gorgeous. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, and it's that um, with droplets as well, water droplets. That is beautiful. That <gasps> looks like it's the grape, isn't it? And the blues yeah. and some of the metallics there. Look at that lovely shimmer. And the, the clouds are really clear, That's aren't they? Wow. Really, really beautiful. 
goodness oh, me. Oh, thank you so much. Nice. Yeah. I'm inspired so much. Thank you. <laughs> so thank I'm you so, so much, Sarah. Sure. Really lovely to see them. If you, um, if you maybe have got some in your cupboard, um, you've been inspired. Um, do send us the pictures. Uh, it's uh, pop it on the Facebook page or at studio or at hochanda.com. Right, so what I thought we'd do now is just show you that you can actually have a little bit of fun with this. So okay. um, I'm just going to get some really soft blues. So this is cotton candy, just right. checking the colour before I said anything. And this is from the 1950s, um, 50s diner one. And this is aqua dolce. Mm. which is nice and soft, is, delicate blue, which is a lovely blue. But I'm also going to mix that with a little bit of the blueberry as well. Okay, so mm. we've got the blueberry and the aqua dolce. Okay. Okay. And then I've got one of the finger daubers. I've is that the one that you get in? In the accessory in pack. The it's a really useful accessory pack that actually. You get loads of stuff in it. So you get lots of um, different shaped spatulas, which are really handy. I didn't realise until you actually got different shapes. And you're like, actually, this is so much better for a certain job. Yeah. So, um, so that's really cool. And you get 10 of these, uh, I call them dobbers, but they're daubers. <laughs> but I always think of, you know, dobby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pick up a little bit of colour, okay? Okay. And I'm just going to start by just, just dabbing and let it, because the, the watercolour paper is still wet. Okay. And I'm just making sort of cloud. Oh, lovely. Cloudish shapes cloudish shapes <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean oh and I've picked up some red oh. <laughs> here we go here we go they're all they're all laughing at me now what have you done there we go baby wipe oh it's gone there and we the, go there have been a lot of questions Kate um can yeah. you use because they're water-based can you use these on fabric you can, but I don't believe that they're permanent yeah. on fabric. You would have to mix them with a, uh, like um, our fabric slap it on in yeah. order to um, give it a delivery system. So um, yes, you could, um, but you do need to mix them with that. But as a pigment, um, yes. Um, but uh, to be on the safe side, um, I would test a piece before hand washing it, yeah. um, even with mixing it with the fabric medium, okay. like uh, the fabric slap it on because I haven't, I haven't tested that yet. So I suppose good. unless you want to do a piece, uh, a piece of art or something on material oh, but and then you don't have to wash it. Yeah, if it's a wall hanging, most mm. definitely. Um, because um, I'm sure there's a, there's a company on, um, I can't remember what they're called now, but they're on Hachanda and they do these beautiful pieces of um, fabric printed with images and then you colour them in. This yeah. would work really, yeah. really well for it actually. So I'm just edging this in the same blue with the dauber all the way around. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to get that green. Was it Pink Ink Designs? That yes, you were thinking of? Pink Ink. Oh, well done. It wasn't me. It was, it was oh. in my ear. So <laughs> thank who, you, Gemma. Who was it? Was it Gemma? Gemma. It well was done, Gemma. Gemma. Thank you, Gemma. <laughs> yeah, they're beautiful, those. And I just want to wet the bottom a little bit and just take some of that, mm. there we go. Gosh, that's a lovely earthy green, isn't it? It is, isn't it? And in actual fact, it's, it was a little bit dirty on the end, it was mixed with purple, and I thought, oh no, that's actually going to work really, really well. Yeah. So if I let that just pull up, that's gonna work really nicely by mm. just bringing up some grasses there. And if you go over the stalks as well, that's going to mix the, the stalks in. It's beautiful. So this is a bit more traditional, isn't yeah. it? Rather than my other other piece, which is and look, we've got a tiny bit of purple in there, but I, I don't really like, like yeah. that. Yeah. So they're lovely, aren't they? they? You can do so many techniques with them. Well, that that's the beauty of them. So you can you can use them depending on what sort of artist you are or yeah. crafter. 
whether you know you enjoy doing um, some cards and some small pieces whether you want to do great big swathing canvases of watercolors yeah you know it, it just doesn't matter they're so versatile that's what I like about them and the fact that you can use them for lots and lots of different um, techniques and different uses mm -hmm. so you can just build them up and keep on keep on going with that and I'm then I'm just going to layer up see I've got that purple mixed in there mm -hmm. I think I'll just put a little bit Oh, isn't that nice? That. Oh, yeah, um, I like that. So that was that was pistachio, yeah, and grape mixed together. Wow. Now that's the sort of thing I'd go. Oh, I'll put a tiny bit of that in the back of my journal and yeah. write it down and just okay. put what I've done because I'd never remember that again. That's a good idea. Do you keep a journal? Yeah, just with um, paints that I've mixed as well. Yeah. But I also have um, an art journal that I just sort of use for doodling and. You know just trying out that's what I was experimenting with this um, these colors I was just sort of having a little play with them and that. smooching them around and putting papers on top and stamping with them and making that's little gorgeous. tags and stuff like that so yeah <laughs> they're, they're just sorry I'm in there, there saying all oh, my secrets are in there Possibly, yes. Yes, don't show everybody. <laughs> um, so, yeah, so you can just carry on um, creating um, a scene like that and we can actually just water this down a little bit and just come in a little bit more oh. and just make it a little bit more vignette, yes. Thank you. Sorry, I'm, I'm talking to the voice in my head. I shouldn't do that. I shouldn't answer them when you can't hear me. I'm not going mad, it's, honestly. There's some some people think madness. I am. Yeah. <laughs> but <laughs> there is a little voice in my ear. <laughs> um, so you can do something quite pretty yeah. um, and quite landscapey, but it was just to show you really the difference with your stamping. It's quite different yeah. to the other mixed media piece. So I'm going to clear up. Give me sure. about one minute, uh, okay, one no and a half problem. minutes, and I'll be back with a quick flyer, lots of techniques. Okay, okay. lovely. Um, so these are the Faber Castel Gelatos. They are absolutely phenomenal. And um, this is the one day special as well. So it ends at eight o'clock um, tonight. Everything is on the website. Um, everything on the show. It's not just the one day special. You've also got some fantastic canvases there. Now, you just saw Kay doing those beautiful cornflowers and dandelions. If you are more into, uh, more of a watercolor artist, maybe you're more into landscapes, um, then maybe these canvases would be great, especially if you've got your gelato. Um, and you can really spread that colour out. You can make very vibrant pieces. Um, and this canvas is fantastic quality. It really is beautiful in a variety of different sizes. Um, it's all on the website there. Um, perfect to use with your gelatos or with any products that you've already got. But there's also um, the one day special on there as well. Um, and accessory packs. And um, also there's some um, black paper on there as well so lots on the website hochanda.com and of course if you'd like to catch up on um, Kay's demonstrations from last night and today and then you can look at catch up as well so let's get back to the one day special this is the Faber Castell gelatos mix and match absolutely gorgeous we have two bundles for you and they are only 29 pounds and 99 pence for four packs and also a beautiful pad of watercolour paper, which is which is just lovely quality. Um, Twenty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence for all of that, but it goes back up tonight to forty-one pounds and ninety-one pence at eight o'clock. Um, it's been very very busy, so definitely get yours now. Let's have a little closer look. Um, this here is the um, is the special edition bundle that you're looking at now. It's got the neutral, um, which is just down here. Um, beautiful skin tones, greys, blacks, um, and a lovely kind of taupe colour too. Then you've also got um, the next door to that is the metallic. Um, no, it's not. That is the. Um, uh, there we go. Which one is that? Masquerade. Is that the masquerade? masquerade. That's the masquerade. That's masquerade. That's masquerade. Um, beautiful colours sorry, there. Th this is masquerade. Oh, sorry. This That's is masquerade. masquerade. Which is the this is the diner. Yes. Um, that, that the purple one, is... one down at the bottom. That is the metallic, and then the other one's neutral. Ah, right. There so those are all metallics. 
and they're all ma wow they're, thank you Kate <laughs> they're all metallics um, and then you also have the masquerade and the 50s diner as well really special colors and they're so lovely they're creamy um, you can mix them you can make them very very delicate like you saw Kay just do or you can make them really bright um, fantastic for your mixed media put lots of um, paper lace on there anything you want so they've got lots of different effects that you can use with them um, and they're really not known very well in this country and um, they've been all over the world um, but this is one of the first times that they're actually brought here to you um, so it's a fantastic deal uh, for a product I don't know why they haven't been brought here they're absolutely gorgeous um, and you can do so much with them plus um, you get this watercolor pad as well and the brushes and the four packs um, so it's just a phenomenal deal 255912 is your item number and those um, are the uh, the special edition bundles. Now the second um, pack are the brights. You get stamps in these ones as well. They are bright. You've got the oranges, you've got the yellows, you've got the pinks, the greens, the blues. Um, but again, you can water them down. They're still bright, but you can water them down to make these beautiful kind of mixed colours. And they mix so beautifully. They've got, they've got that kind of creamy texture. Um, so they do mix beautifully and they just give the most phenomenal effect. Um, you can use them on canvases, you can use them on watercolour. Um, just lots and lots of things you can do with them. We'll show you um, a few samples in a minute as well. In fact, here's Kay to show you a few samples. Um, <laughs> but these are the brights. They're under the same item number, 255912. So if you want both packs, um, they're the same item number. So it's just one P and P, £21, £9.99. You're saving £11.92 until 8 o'clock tonight. Um, so definitely get yours before then. Right, let's see a few samples okay. um, just to see all the different things that they can do. Okay, so we've got, um, these are some of the brights here, um, lovely backgrounds these. Um, this is all textured and I love this sort of textured look to them, sorry. Oops. That's Sue Ralph, you oh, can just gorgeous. see all that lovely texture and how clear um, those colours are. Wow. Uh, and that's the stencil in the middle there. Um, and then we've got, again, more stenciling, uh, smooching together, technical term obviously, <laughs> you know. <laughs> Um, and those are the metallic range in the um, special edition. Beautiful, because you can't gorgeous. tell so much on the packaging, can you? you? Can't. But once you get them out. But once you get them out, you can see that lovely shimmer, actually, that you have with them, which is really lovely. Um, then we've got another one by uh, Elizabeth Robinson here. And she's actually done some colouring in with them with a watercolour. Um, and again, some lovely background textures there those. with stenciling and the resist technique that we did earlier yeah so she's done a really lovely yeah job gorgeous and <laughs> just chucking them everywhere there Ooh, we go this is different that's gorgeous isn't yeah. it i think that's probably um sue okay. ralph actually yeah um and she's done again just stamping resist and then colored it in but she's actually done swathes of it and those are the neutrals aren't they gorgeous i love the neutrals really lovely and she's got a bit of the 1950s diner in there as well that's my favourite one. So it's a really lovely product if you want something new, um, if you've been doing lots of mixed media, lots of um, painting, but you're a little bit bored of something, you want to try something new. Um, Absolutely. A really lovely product. Absolutely. That's with. why I love them. They're, uh, they're so much fun, they really are. And you're just going to love getting them out. So try some of the techniques that we've been doing today yeah. um, and, uh, and on the hour. And just have a play with them. Just cut yourself loads of small pieces of watercolour card, like I'm just going to do now, and just play with different... Uh, try different things out. Yeah, lovely. So £29.99 and pence, and this is the one day special but only until 8 o'clock when it goes back up to £41.91. and pence. You've got the brights or you've got the special edition. You get four packs and a pack of watercolour paper um, in each. So you choose between the special edition and the blight brights um, and your item number is 255912. Um, give us a call on 01733 or you can go on to hochanda.com um, on which there may be some other things that you might like you might find to add to your order and um, these are the uh, more metallics wow they're beautiful <gasps> they are goodness delicious me. Absolutely, absolutely beautiful delicious. 
in fact. So they're the Faber Castell um, metallics. Lots of you have been shopping ahead for these. You can see why they're incredible. These are £22.99. Don't forget with all of these um, that they're just an extra couple of days delivery, um, but they are well worth the wait. 980866, your item number for the metallics. Um, and then we've also got some lovely black card. The metallics would look amazing on the black part card, wouldn't they? They Nine do. Pounds and 99 pence. Um, you get 100 sheets all in all. 287496 is your item number. Um, and yes, again, just think how wonderful they look on those. But also fantastic for your crafty stash um, if you're looking for some black paper. Right, so um, starting the next demo, so I've, okay. uh, I've jumped ahead, um, so I've started to lay down some colour and yeah. I've actually used some of the, um, oh gosh, orange, mm -hmm. <laughs> blood, blood red, <laughs> funnily enough, banana and um, chocolate, but I, I Ooh, thought, oh you okay. mentioned metallic, so this yes. is the iced chai, <gasps> isn't that Ooh. just delicious? That lovely. Wow. In fact, I've just had an idea. Right, so if I do this. Oh, these are the metallics, yes. Yeah, I was concentrating the, on you, I didn't actually I know, see. No, they're gorgeous. <gasps> actually, the iced pear is just to die for. It really, really is. So I'm just going to lay down some That's of this one. chocolate here. Sorry. And I need some of this banana. And then I'm going to come in with the <gasps> metallic in a moment. But okay. first of all, let me just pop this colour down. So we're going for real sort of autumn um, autumn colours here. Yep. Get your baby wipe. Okay. Uh -huh. And then start your baby wipe dance. <laughs> 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 that's going to stick now, that, isn't it? Is. it? That, that, that's, that's what this technique is called now. It's the baby <laughs> wipe dance. dance, yeah. <laughs> it's incredible you don't actually have to add water, really. No, because they're so lovely and creamy. Yeah. It's great. It's really, really nice. So let me just put all that down there. Okay. And I think, actually, I'm going to put a little bit more red on top of that before we go in with metallic. Yeah like this and then smooch all of that in there we go I'm going to activate that with a little bit of water okay. as well Ooh. Ooh, it yes. really does change it doesn't it it does it changes the whole feeling of it now this is without gesso um, okay. and there, therefore it's grabbing hold of the card a little bit more okay, okay. so I'm just going to Blast that off for a second. I'm then going to get my Ooh, one minute. cobs left. What? There's only one minute. There's left. only one minute. <gasps> no, no, no. Oh no! Is that, I can't believe it. Where did the time go? So then you get your baby wipe. Yeah. And then you actually start to remove. Okay. Okay. You remove that. But then, this is like called the mosaic. I don't know what it's called, but I, I sort of think of it like a mosaic. And then I'm getting a metallic. Yeah. I'm putting it over this stencil, and then using your finger, Ooh. you just move it round. Hopefully, you'll see this. So just ima okay. imagine. Oh, <gasps> look at that! Oh. Oh. Isn't oh, that gorgeous? Wow. So you can imagine the whole thing done yeah. in that. That's going to look amazing, isn't it? That's and gorgeous. Should we do, give it a wiggle. I've oh, got time to got give it a wiggle. Nine seconds. No, we have totally okay, worth I'll it. To close but up. I'll tell you what. We'll have a little look later when we come back, um, and we will be back in a bit for the one-day special. We'll see you then. So lots coming up next. Um, we've got Charlie coming up. Um, with Stamp Addicts, uh, then after that there's a Spectrum Illustrator birthday weekend wow with Fiona and myself and then I'll be back after that with Kay for the Faber-Castell one day special.